Greetings of peace to one and all. Today's good news points out to us that we are blessed if we believe as Mary did. I'm Sister Rosalie. Join me in discovering the beauty of God's Word through the Gospel power of today. While Jesus was saying this, a woman in the crowd raised her voice and said to him, Blessed is the womb that bore you and the breasts that nursed you. But he said, Blessed rather are those who hear the word of God and obey it. Jesus shifts the focus of the anonymous woman's praise from an aspect which is exclusive to his mother to an aspect which is open to all believers. Mary's physical maternity is her unique privilege. The Word of God became flesh in her womb, and this will never be repeated. But all believers are called to give flesh to the Word in their lives by being its listeners and doers. In this, Mary also excelled. The Word became flesh in her womb because she listened to the angel's announcement and surrendered her life to it. She was the first disciple of the Word, and this is the blessedness that Jesus points to, for it is accessible and possible to all believers. Lord Jesus, Word of God, as we listen to you, awaken in our hearts a restlessness that will find fulfillment only in doing what you say. Amen. We stand before you, Holy Spirit, as we gather together in your name. With you alone to guide us, make yourself at home in our hearts. Teach us the way we must go and how we are to pursue it. We are weak and sinful. Do not let us promote disorder. Do not let ignorance lead us down the wrong path, nor partiality influence our actions. Let us find in you our unity, so that we may journey together to eternal life, and not stray from the way of truth and what is right. All this we ask of you, who are at work in every place and time, in the communion of the Father and the Son, forever and ever. <laughs> 